what seemingly looks like a, a pack of cigarettes, maybe with a little Christmas ornament coming out of a box, really is an important uh, historical item. This was a pack of cigarettes that R.J. Reynolds was sending out to its mailing list, to people who'd gotten on there somehow, uh, presumably of people who smoke camel cigarettes, to coincide with Christmas. Uh, seasons, greetings, camel smokers deserve something special uh, for the holidays. Here it is. It's our way of saying thanks for staying smooth with camel, the camel family. I mean, that hits all the notes, family and, and uh, the holidays and seasons, greetings. And it, it has the gold, which is part of their uh, motif. It's just a great marketing item get a free pack of cigarettes in the mail for, you know, just wishing you Merry Christmas. But the significance of that is that's not the 1930s or 40s or 50s when everybody gave cartons of cigarettes for Christmas. That's really the 1990s. So for basically the better part of the 20th century, Christmas was associated with giving cigarettes. I am just still son that that you could send cigarettes through the mail, even into the 90s. You would think that would be, you know, th this is a little bit of a tangent, but it's like, you know, let's yeah. keep kids from just going and raiding through mailboxes other than, well, you know, it's federal, yeah. federal No, I mean, crime, you know, they, yeah. they, that's, you know, cigarettes are, are, are you know, uh, they're legal products, so they're not necessarily going to... It's you know, they send whiskey well, to... So, well, so is alcohol. And like, yeah. only recently did they rule, yeah. at least here in the state, that you could send I, that by mail. I think we, we could look that up in terms of whether anyone ever tried to see whether sending cigarettes by mail. Uh, I think the bigger issue here is unsolicited cigarettes. Here's somebody right. getting a pack of cigarettes in the mail that they didn't ask for, that if it's in the general mail, a child could open that up. But I yeah. think that, that raises a question there. But I okay. think that this just symbolizes the 20th century to me. Well, this is one of the items that best symbolizes the 20th century oh, yeah. uh, in the whole collection because it says, um, you know, after all we've learned here, Merry Christmas and then Happy New Year with a pack of camels. It's it's the it's the gross combination of, of you know the Yuletide greeting, seasons greetings with the with these with these death sticks. It it's parody almost like you you would see this yeah. in a in a movie, you know, or a cartoon. Yeah.